What's up guys, it's Marieta and greetings from Miami. So I decided to take some break. I'm here for five days and uh, leaving tonight. So back to business, but I wanted to show you a little bit of Florida. In fact, Miami to be precise. And And uh, I also wanted to uh, talk a little bit about if you are moving to the US, where should you go? Because some of you guys don't know. And so basically, like you might have questions like, where do you want to go? And, uh, you know, like, what's the best place to move if you have family, if you're single? Because these things all matters, right? It's different for everybody. So let me, let me just cross this road. Okay. okay, so basically if you are, because many of my clients who are actually families, they are, tend to, they tend to move to, uh, they tend to move to Florida and they do that because, first of all, the real estate is just way, way, way more affordable compared to other states. Like if I compare it to San Francisco, California, or even San Diego, like I'm talking huge difference. Let me give you an example. One bedroom here costs about $2,000 and it's about 750 square feet, whereas in San Francisco, California, you have it for 4,000. So, so literally you do have the double price there. And as you can see here, it's like super hot all year round. In California, not so much. Sorry for the noise. So let me pass it. crazy that guy was blocking the road okay so yeah so basically the prices in real estate are totally uncomparable and then the second thing is if you want to be in an environment that is really warm then Florida is the go-to place obviously if you prefer something more mild then California would be the place and if you ask me personally, I lived in New York, I lived in Chicago, I lived in San Diego, and now I'm in San Fran. If you are coming to the US without your family, you wanna start a business, <coughs> then again, it depends what kind of business. Like, see, if you live in New York, New York is quite expensive and uh, it's just overcrowded place. So if you want to have that lifestyle, I, I wouldn't go to New York. Now, there are a bunch of great schools in Chicago. I, I went to one of them, so you might want to consider that. Uh, but definitely, this would be the place if you are a family that is looking for to settle or you want to even invest into real estate. And, you know, you want to have like a family house here, beach house, then definitely go for it. So I'm just gonna show you around and I'm gonna show you the beach because the beach is very clean. I love it here. But I probably wouldn't wanna live here because it's too hot and it's just too much. All right guys, I'm a little bit slow because I'm walking. Yeah, let me show you the street. Now, when it comes to incorporating business here, there are people who choose to do that. And it's certainly better and faster than 
uh, California because you don't have the franchise tax, which is kind of high. In California, you have $800. You don't have it here. Uh, so it's more affordable. I think it's the annual fee, it's lower than in Delaware. In Delaware, you have it around 300, I believe, which is the annual filing fee, the franchise tax. I think here it's even lower than that. I'm pretty sure it's lower. So obviously, if you do business here, if you want to stay here, if you want to be, you know, you want to settle here, then I would say definitely the way to go. So we are almost at the beach. Almost there. Maybe I took a wrong road. Oops, never mind. Wrong road. I gotta go different way. <laughs> See, I'm new here. I don't know the area well. Uh, ready. Can I go there? I think I'm going there. So, yeah, so this is it. This is the American dream place, I say. And now, obviously, you gotta work here or you gotta invest. There's no such a thing as just being here and doing nothing. So obviously, if you are someone who wants to start a business, let's say you are a young entrepreneur, I recommend to go to California. Probably it's better for you because this place seems more for people who are already accomplished and they just want to chill. Um, so I will go to California instead. But if you are family and if you want to have a place that is, you know, comfortable, on the beach, sort of affordable, then go with Florida. People looking at me while I'm talking with my phone because I'm recording video. Okay, I hope I found the entrance. Almost there. Honestly, I think I got lost. But let's see if I find it. It's so hot, guys. It's like 28. I think 28. 28 Celsius. Maybe 30. It's too hot for me. <coughs> okay, we are almost there. Because the beach is really clean. It's not like beach in California and it's really warm as well, so it's a big deal. Almost there. This is it. That's what I'm saying. All right, let me show you closer. how clean it is gorgeous it's a beautiful beach so that's it guys the video is over and I'm about to jump to the water so I'll see you in my next video let me know if you like this one 
leave a comment below and if you are watching my videos and you haven't subscribed make sure to subscribe and also hit the bell on the side so you are receiving new updates and i'll see you in the new video bye